welcome back my guys uh to the channel if you guys are new well welcome i got a single turbo mustang that i'm trying to go fast as much as possible uh today i'm updating you uh with uh what i've done so far lately uh what i'm preparing to go uh, to the drag strip uh this thursday coming up is friday at the moment so a whole week a week to uh, kind of prepare but uh something i did some good uh prep work today and i'm going to show you exactly what i did today so check this out enjoy this video guys for those of you guys who've been keeping up with me i have the what do you call it oh, I, heard it's stuck on this. I heard a two-step up on here i should be able to hold 35 easy let's see let me adjust this all right let's see where we're at guys this thing should hold 3600 <laughs> on the two step and on uh so the trans brakes on that's uh the trans brakes engaged with my two step so right now i got my button right here just because i don't want it in the way but typically it'll be right here so let's see what this this girl does don't even move at all uh so it looks it's a 3500 stall it didn't go past the 3500 mark so it's uh it's good so that means i can use 3500 uh it's hopefully hopefully i could that can benefit because that's 200 rpms higher than what i was at the line at the line last track strip i was at, at a 3300 so let's see how it looks one more time i'm curious to see my boots there we go so the longer let me go for a drive the longer i hold up that stall the more boost pressure i can pick up so right now i got up to about two pounds but i'm gonna try to hold it up there a little while longer and right now it's negative but you'll see this thing turn positive and it'll be at hopefully next time i go to the drag strip i got my camera on or my helmet and you'll be able to see that thing spool up so it looks like spooled it up it went to like 0.5 to one two got to like 2.1 so that's real good so i'm really happy about that everything is working out exactly how i anticipated it all right guys uh i'm back uh from the little test drive uh, the whole purpose of the whole test drive was to try to get my transmission a little bit warm so I can really get up on it, on that trans brake. And uh, and I have two goals in mind today. One, I wanted to see if I can get up to 3,600 RPMs or will basically get up to as high as I can on that stall that I have in it. It's an aftermarket Circle D uh, stall uh, that I have in it. And two, I wanted to see if I can get up on it on the trans brake and see how much boost or even if builds boost on the trans brake. So uh, I did, uh, as you obviously seen, 
some of the clips of me going in the strip. I mean strip. I wish I was at the strip on the street. And then coming back here and practicing this uh this little trans break thing on my on my driveway there. Uh first I went on there and uh changed it from 3300 because that's as high as I was able to get on the drag strip last video. If you guys haven't seen it, check that video out. 72 at 100. Uh I was able to go from 3300 stall to 35, which is the limit. Put it up to 36, but uh but it stops at 35 because that's all it's capable. Okay, so that's one. I gotta check that off the list. That works. And then second. I wanted to see if I can build up some boost because my whole biggest thing at the track is that this turbo here that I got, uh, 88, 69, uh, it really likes high RPMs. It really likes going down the track. It likes getting up on the speed, right? But off the line, I was very sluggish. I was at a 7.2 at 100. It just doesn't really add up, right? When I was running a 6.8, uh, 6.7, 6.8, 6.9 on nitrous, I was coming in at 98, 99, 100 miles an hour. So that's because I was able to engage nitrous right off the bat, given a 1.4 to 1.5, 60 foot. This time I had a 1.7, 60 foot. Uh, last time I went to the drag shoot with the turbo. So that means I'm not getting off the line pretty much minimal or no boost. So what I noticed right here, what you guys seen and I mentioned on the video, is that I was able to get on the trans brake and I had to give it a little bit, let it spool up a little bit, and I was able to get up to about 2, 2.5 pounds of boost and that's just barely getting on it. Right, so that's good. So that means when I was at the drag strip, I was barely getting on it. I wasn't building basically no boost. So I was coming off the line all motor and then coming off and then finally getting into into boost, probably about, you know, considerably maybe about 60 feet off, maybe 100 feet. So that's no bueno, right? I need to get off the line hard. So that's what I'm doing now. That's what was the point of this video to see if I can get up to the highest stall I can possibly get, which is 3,500, and to see if I can build a boost. Uh, my peak boost right now, it's at 8.4. Uh, my tuner said, let's try to shoot for 14. Uh, don't really have the space to do that on the street. So I couldn't get up to the 14, but I'm going to leave it at eight, right? It's on 10% duty cycle. Once I get to the drag strip, I'm going to go up to 25% duty cycle because that's what's recommended and see if I can get into that 10, 11. I'm hoping I can get at least to that 10, 11 would be great on 25%. And then I can work from there to try to get to that 14. And then once I reach my peak, hopefully 14 something, because max over boost is gonna be 15. I can set that as my peak boost and we can work from there. And then I can go to with my gain and sensitivity and see how if we can work those, because that's gonna help me spool up that turbo a lot quicker out by on the line. I know it's a lot I'm throwing at you, boom. I've been thinking about this for like the past two weeks. Just been doing a lot. Past two weeks from welding to the house. Haven't been able to get out here to the Mustang, but now I can. Mustang, uh, I'm, I'm really happy with the results today. Guys, I was able to get up on that stall. I was able to build up some boost, even if it was 10 pounds, but at least I'm seeing it build up. Everything is going to how I wanted to go right now. All we have to do right now is keep her healthy, make it to the drag strip, hopefully on the 14th of July get some good numbers feel good with the numbers and hopefully we can get close to that 14 pounds if not get it on that peak boost and then start adjusting my my peak and, and uh i mean not my peak my gain and sensitivity uh it, it's just trying there guys it's it's getting there I'm, I'm diving right into the turbos i was a nitrous guy before this so it's a whole different kind of setup whole different way you go about it but i'm loving this turbo setup and that's basically uh everything for this video man uh, i don't want to go and ramble on too much gave you guys the gist if you guys haven't seen some of my last videos check it out man car is picking up speed it's just when you gotta get out that hole a lot harder uh and hopefully we can get some good numbers hopefully hopefully i can get into into those mid sixes if not uh, uh six eight would i would be nice on on the 14th that's a, a good goal hopefully a little quicker because now that i'm getting a handle on this turbo and picking up that boost maybe we can get some better results so uh that's it for this video guys uh cleaning out my garage man been doing a lot mustang sitting in here comfortably getting a new battery for that fz right there i need to ride that and this battery went dead as well so order that up mustang's feeling hot uh it's it's coming guys it's, it's coming along man thank you guys for tuning in like i said if you want to catch some more mustang content turbo mustang content check out my videos man other than that enjoy your weekend guys and I'll catch you guys very, very soon, man.